Hey, what's going on guys? Perfect Nightmare here doing a somewhat different type of Battlefield video. This is actually a live commentary while I basically discuss the way I do my customizations here on the gun bench. As you guys know, I run a lot of customizations on uh, a lot of my guns, especially with uh, my sniper rifle, the, uh, the, the M98B. Um, but someone actually recently told me, how do you make these red um, splatter type um, camos? And I'm going to tell you right now, it is actually fairly easy to do. It just requires more of your time and patience to actually get it perfectly right. So I'm going to start this off uh, best way possible is basically by getting a gun in which I know will have a perfect uh, sheet over what we see currently right now on the screen. So right now I'm going to try to look around for a good gun. Um, the best gun I could probably think of right now currently is the M11. Um, the M11. So we'll pick that out real quick. Not even worry about the customizations on the optics or anything like that. But head over to the camo section and basically scroll down. You can have three picks to it. You can pick the spray paint camo, the um, polygon camo, or the skull camo. I'm going with the skull camo. Now we're going to go ahead and pick the colors. Uh, obviously, your color number one is always going to be the particular red. Make sure it stays red. Particular number two is going to be black. Color number three, black. And color number four is going to be red. Now by this, you can already tell where the camo is already sticking out on it. Um, obviously, you're seeing some differences. So now we're going to zoom in. Now you can see, still see a little bit of the reminiscence of uh, red still in there. But slightly press on the right trigger and left trigger as quick as possible. And you got yourself a little bit more of a more cleaner fresh look of the camo. Now when you back away from, a, from it, it looks a little bit more like little blood drips or not really blood drips, but more of a blood splatter on the thing. Um, if you don't really like the idea of that, you can actually do this. Um, instead of using skull camo, go ahead and go over to the spray paint camo. And by here you can actually see, see it like a blood smear type deal. Now again, you're going to want to go ahead and go to surface editor and do the left and right thing to make it uh, more just basically more fresh and when you back out it looks completely and utterly awesome on the red and this is basically my tutorial on how I usually get my colors to look a little bit more like bloodshot red I'll be doing more of these uh, until the release of Battlefield 5 and stay tuned for more updates more videos and stuff like that on Perfect Nightmare 